My name is Assad Tarsin, and I serve uh, the Muslim Community Center of the East Bay in Pleasanton. Um, I would like to begin in the name of God, the compassionate, the merciful. Uh, and I want to thank Rabbi Larry for taking the lead and gathering us here together. Uh, it is quite um, a heartwarming experience to be united uh, with our brethren in, in faith here against hate, against division, and against a senseless loss of life. Many of the great gifts of religion are to help us to understand and deal with these calamities that befall us. Um, and each of our holy scriptures has things to help us to deal with this. One of the interesting aspects for Muslims is that this actually really resembles the life of the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. He was born in a tribalistic society where division and hate led to senseless violence. And instead of calling people to tribalism, he came with a simple message that I think was very powerful and useful to everyone, that we are all members of the human family. We are from the tribe of Adam and Eve. That's from where we all come, and we are all one human family. Later in the scriptures, we learn of the tragic story of Cain and Abel, which is a shared tradition um, in the three faiths that I see represented here. And there we learn of senseless violence and the types of spiritual illnesses, the envy, the jealousy, uh, hatred that leads to it. And in these lessons are reminders for us to help to contribute to a spirit uh, and a sense in our communities of love, of forgiveness, and of breaking down barriers. I join my uh, brothers and sisters here in reminding us all that we have an individual responsibility to work within our spheres of influence, in our homes, with our friends, at work, to work to remove these barriers of ignorance. When we see the other as part of us and part of our family, these types of acts become much harder uh, to imagine. And senseless violence, I think, is one of the hardest things for a person um, who's healthy uh, to understand and to make sense of. And one of the great gifts that we have is that in this is a reminder of the blessing of life. And so in this moment, uh, I would like to thank everyone here and say that we should commit ourselves to, to leading lives that bring light and hope and peace wherever we go. And I will close with the greeting um, that is traditional in the Muslim faith. Peace be upon you all. And thank you for having me.